The Cognitech TriSuite software package includes Cognitech Video Investigator, Cognitech Video Active, and Cognitech Auto Measure. Video Investigator is Cognitech's comprehensive video processing platform for extracting the utmost available clarity from image or video sources. One of Video Investigator's newest functions, Geometric Lens Correction, will be covered in this interactive tutorial. Welcome to the Cognitech Video Investigator Geometric Lens Correction Tutorial. This interactive tutorial will focus on how lens distortion affects evidence and how geometric lens correction can fix the problem. Geometric lens distortion causes a discrepancy between straight lines in the scene and what is captured. These distortions may change the shape of objects and cause measurement errors. Cognitech camera calibration can be used to remove lens distortion, utilizing several pictures taken of the calibration test pattern. Cognitech camera calibration can be found in Cognitech Auto Measure and Cognitech Video Active. However, camera calibration requires access to the original camera, which is often not possible. Geometric lens correction removes lens distortion by tracing real-world straight lines. This method does not require access to the original camera. The glyph tool will be used to trace real-world straight lines in the video that have been distorted by the lens distortion. The glyph tool is found in Video Investigator's toolbox, located on the left side of the interface. Pressing the Glyph tool reveals several Glyph tool options. The Open Polygon Glyph tool allows a user to trace a feature or object in Video Investigator. The Geometric Lens Correction filter is found in the Transform menu. The Geometric Lens Correction filter can remove blur with a user-defined glyph, visual adjustment, or by a saved calibration file. Glyph lens correction parameters can be saved to a calibration file for use at another time in any of the TriSuite products. Lens distortion can be seen in this video surveillance footage. Notice how the lens distortion causes straight lines to be bent. Geometric lens correction is found in the transform category. Choose the geometric lens correction filter. Open the Glyph tool. Select the Open Polygon Glyph tool. Objects like light posts are good objects to trace because they are straight in the true scene. Trace the light post by placing a series of glyph points. Right click to close the glyph. Notice the black boundaries of the distortion corrected video frames. The black boundaries are the true limits of the captured video frame. This process removes distortion from video while preserving all of the pixel information. Click continue to move on. Another glyph can be placed on this line, but a vehicle is covering the line. However, geometric lens correction allows the user to place glyphs on any frame of the video. Click on frame 41. Trace the white line on the road by placing a series of glyph points. Right click to close the glyph. The second glyph has been applied, changing the lens correction parameters and updating the distortion corrected window. Click process to apply geometric lens correction to each of the frames.
The distortion corrected result has been processed. Click Finish to close the geometric lens correction filter. Lens distortion can also be corrected with a second method that does not require tracing lines in the video. Manual lens correction provides a manual visual method of removing lens distortion utilizing the control and resultant windows. The control window allows the user to manually adjust the amount of lens distortion correction. The resultant window provides a reference grid for aligning distorted lines. Click Manual Correction to start manual lens correction. The distortion corrected window grid needs to be adjusted to match a distorted line in the video. Clicking and dragging the grid lines allows the user to determine when distorted lines become straight. The grid interface allows the user to align the grid lines with the distorted lines in the image. The user will then manually adjust the control window interface until the undistorted lines match the grid line. Clicking and dragging the green squares adjust the amount of lens correction applied. Click Process to apply geometric lens correction to each of the frames. The distortion corrected result has been processed. Click Finish to close the geometric lens correction filter. Geometric lens correction removes lens distortion without access to the original camera. Toggle the checkbox to compare before and after geometric lens correction. Here is a comparison between the original video and the geometric lens correction video. Click continue to end this tutorial. You have now successfully corrected a video with geometric lens correction using both the glyph method and the manual method. Try geometric lens correction and see how it can more accurately correct lens distortion in your evidence. If you would like to return to the beginning, click Restart Course. For sales or technical questions, contact us at sales at Cognitech.com or tech support at Cognitech.com or visit us at www.cognitech.com.